Today I have some cool tricks to help you optimize and maximize your use of the OBS user interface. You can do so much with it, but a lot of people really don't. So let me show you how to do it. Let's get to it. So let's talk a little bit about our UI. This is really, really pretty confusing. There's just so much stuff here. So I like to always put this over here and this way I kind of have the list. It makes it really easy to see what we have going on here and switch through it. You can even right click on this and go to grid mode so that you can see your scenes written out. Now you're, you're probably going to want to name your scenes better than I did here. But this is just, you know, for an example. Another thing that you can do, I, I'm not sure people actually realize this, but these are stackable. So once you start your stream, you don't really need to have all of this stuff here. I can stack this right on top of there. It makes it a lot easier. You can switch back and forth if you need to. But now all the main focus is on my scenes over here. I've got my sources for the scene right here. And we have the audio mixer. Now, you don't really want to have to scroll through the audio stuff either, so you can actually right click on here and you can select vertical layout. And now you have all of your audio sources really easy to see right there. You can adjust this up and down if you like. It's pretty simple. And then most people are going to have another box over here with their chat or something like that. But you can use all of this stuff to your advantage. We could even make it simpler by putting this over top of that. So now we can switch back and forth between our sources. But now we have a really, really simple layout that makes it easy to just see the things that we actually need to see without all the other confusing stuff that we don't need to see. Let's say we wanted to drag this out of here again. All we have to do is switch to the sources and we could just grab this and move it back over here. And we're all set. We can resize everything. But use the UI tools to your advantage to make things much more easy to control and see while you're live streaming. A lot of people don't do it, but it really is helpful. Awesome stuff. Is there something about OBS that you would like to see me create a tutorial on? Well, let me know in the comments. And while you're down there, if you're not subscribed, please do. That sort of stuff really does help me continue to make content that helps you. So thanks. And if you're always looking for tools, tips, and tricks that can help make you a better live streamer or YouTuber, subscribe to the channel. My name is Michael Fire Jr. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one.